What's your experience of unruly parents who actually can wreck football matches, which are supposed to be a lot of fun for their kids? Well, yeah, I mean, you've hit on that, Mike. Good evening, first and foremost, guys. Hi, yeah, everyone. Hi, Jamie. Um, yeah, you, enjoyment is the word that we should all be stressing. I mean, I've got two, two boys that play regularly, and they want to win, which is great. You know, it's great that they want to win, but, you know, enjoyment for me has got to be top of the list. And um, my experience as a parent and a footballer is that you see far too many parents that want to win for them so that they can, win, go, you know, go into the pub or go into work on a Monday and tell all the mates that their son has, you know, has won on, on the Sunday. And, and it's for all the wrong reasons, in my experience. How much of it, James, do you think is actually from the, the end goal, the end world wish of the parent of them wanting to play in the Premier League and they see that the whole the old mapped road or the road's mapped out for them and any sort of uh, detriment was gonna is gonna stop them from being a pro footballer? Well, I think every parent wants their child to be uh, pro footballers. I know my parents did and I would love for mine to be. But, you know, unfortunately, the statistics are heavily against that. Mm. Um, obviously, parents see the fame and the fortune that comes with being a footballer, and they, they kind of want their kids to, to live that lifestyle. Um, but, you know, when you've got kids of seven and eight that are being pressured into playing that don't want to be there, it's incredible. I've, I, had a, I had a friend um, who, who came to me, um, and his son was eight this is only a few weeks ago, and he said, you want to watch my lad, he's the next best thing, he, he could do with an agent, do you know anybody? And I had to say to him, listen, you've really got to, you've got to take a step back, look, mm. when he's 13, 14, 15, uh, come back to me and we'll have a chat, but he's eight. Is that your son next to you, I take it? This is Jack, yeah, he plays, oh, Jack. Uh, he's, he's a Chelsea fan, he plays in under 13 league. Um, you were supposed to bring your child up properly, not make him a Chelsea, Chelsea fan. He has brought him up properly. Right, Jack, <laughs> Jack, I'll just forget about your father for a minute. Does he let you enjoy the game? Does he step back and allow you to play? Yeah. <laughs> yeah? He doesn't t put you under too much pressure then? No. And do, do you feel that's a better way? Do you, do you respond better with that sort of approach? Do you think you feel a bit more pressure if he, he was telling you this and that all the time? Yeah, it would be. Uh, it would make it less enjoyable if he was like shouting and everything. Absolutely, I wish that a lot more parents would behave like that because it would make it better for for their kids.